Now this is the grip, what? Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to be discussing my February TBR. So February is an important month for the bookish community in two ways. So first off we have Blackathon. So Blackathon is a month-long readathon promoting Black History Month and it is hosted by Francina Simone, The Novel Lush, and Bowties and Books. Now I am going to try my hardest to participate in this readathon but I'm not going to do all of the challenges just because I have a lot of things to do this month and I'm also participating in the booktube games run by Mayana from Little Wolf Reads and so I'm probably not going to contribute to winning but I thought it would be fun and I kind of want to make a lot of friends in the bookish community so I decided to join that but basically this video is going to be talking about all of the books that I want to read in February. So the first book that I would like to read in the month of February is Always and Forever Jean by Jenny Han. This is the third book in the To All the Boys I've Loved Before trilogy, so I'm not going to give you a synopsis for this, but I'm very excited to read this because apparently it's better than P.S. I Still Love You, and it's got like a lot of nice cutesy romance tropes in this book, so I figured this would be perfect for Valentine's Day. The next book that I would like to read in the month of February is The Past and Other Things That Should Stay Buried by Sean David Hutcherson. Now this is a book I do believe about zombies. One of our main characters, Dino, his his family runs a funeral home so he's obviously no stranger to death but his best friend July dies and then mysteriously comes back to life and the only thing is is that he's not really that alive he's in between and so it's a book about trying to figure out why the heck his best friend is a zombie and also how their friendship ended so badly so it sounds to me like this is going to be like a contemporary ish fantasy novel about friendship and all of that good stuff I'm hoping there's some uh, gay sh in here because I love Love that gauge. The next book that I would like to read in the month of February is Tyler Johnson Was Here by Jay Coles. Now this is going to be part of my Blackathon TBR and this is going to fill the challenge of reading a book by a black author. This book has been on my shelf for a very long time and I'm very excited to read it because apparently a lot of people really loved this book. So basically this book is about two twins. So it's about Marvin and Tyler and when Tyler, Marvin's twin, goes to a party and mysteriously disappears, Marvin has to try and find him, but he realizes that Tyler was killed by a police officer and so it kind of goes through that theme of police brutality in America and what it does to black communities. So I'm very excited to read this. The next book that I would like to read in February is The Poet X by Elizabeth Acevedo. Now this book is a book that's written in verse about our main character Ziumara who really just wants her mother to accept the fact that she loves spoken word poetry and so when she is invited to join the school's poetry club she's a little bit skeptical because she doesn't want to go around her mom's rules and the tagline here says but still she can't stop thinking about performing her poems because in spite of a world that may not want to hear her Ziomara refuses to be silent. Now this is the group book for Blackathon. I absolutely adore books that are set up in verse so I'm very excited to dive into this one and the last book that I have on my official TBR is of course Children of Blood and Bone by Tomi Ariyami. Now everybody and their mother has absolutely adored this book and I'm very excited to read it because I'm kind of on a fantasy kick right now. It's an African inspired fantasy based off of Avatar The Last Airbender or at least it has a lot of comps to Avatar The Last Airbender and I adore Avatar The Last Airbender. It is one of my favorite cartoons slash TV shows of all all time and I'm just very excited to read about elemental magic and yes very excited. So this will fill the challenge of a romance between two black people. I'm just very excited because apparently the romance is amazing in this and yes so those are all of the books on my official TBR. I might, might be in the keyword, be able to read a little bit more 
depending. Obviously the booktube games are based on how many pages you read, so I'm hoping that I'll be able to read more books, but if not then I think that this is a pretty solid TBR for February. Let me know down in the comments what you are planning on reading in February. Are you reading any books that I'm reading for February? Please let me know. I love to interact with you in the comments section. As always, all of my social media links will be down in the description box below if you would like to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, or read my blog. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye!